Hey there, AI enthusiasts. Today, we're diving into the fascinating world of neural networks in the 1990s. Strap in, because we're about to uncover some interesting insights from the Hacker News post and comments. Back in the day, neural networks were a hot topic. Books and research were aplenty, but there were a few roadblocks that hindered progress. Limited computer power was a major hurdle, making it difficult to process complex neural networks efficiently. And let's not forget about the small data sets that posed a challenge. It's like trying to solve a puzzle with only a few scattered pieces. But that's not all. The aftermath of the AI winter, a period of reduced funding and interest in AI, also played a role in slowing down advancements. It was like a cold front that put a freeze on the AI landscape. Fast forward to today, and we're witnessing an AI renaissance. What's fueling this surge? Well, it's a combination of smarter approaches, increased computational power, and a wealth of data. It's like having a turbocharged engine, a supercomputer, and an ocean of information at our fingertips. One key factor in this AI renaissance is the emergence of large language models, or LLMs. These models have the ability to understand and generate human-like language, opening up a whole new world of possibilities. It's like having a language-savvy AI assistant by your side. But let's not forget the challenges that come with neural networks. Overfitting, where a model becomes too specialized and fails to generalize well, is a constant battle. It's like trying to fit into a pair of shoes that are too small. Early neural networks had their limitations, but we've come a long way since then. So, what's the takeaway from all this? Neural networks in the 1990s faced their fair share of obstacles, but today, we're riding the wave of a new era in AI. With smarter approaches, more computational power, and an abundance of data, the possibilities are endless. Stay tuned for more exciting updates in the world of artificial intelligence. Until then, keep exploring, keep learning, and keep pushing the boundaries of what's possible. This is your host, signing off.